good. Happy Sunday morning to you. Yeah. You guys happy? Oh, yes. They're happy because they're on the computer playing some kind of um, thing can, here where they're... So uh, if you draw, I'll just show you this one. And then if you drive your man on the track, you draw. Oh, oh not no. like that. Oh, poor But guy. they got like... No. Stay. Cancel. I can't leave the page because I'm building like an intricate one. But oh, yeah, okay. you try the... You, if you keep the guy straight keep like that. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. He's like, now he's falling. Falling. And there's falling, no end. Falling. There's no end. Well, you better end it for him. <laughs> so actually, it's a pretty cool. It's a pretty co cool thing there. You draw the track, and you can put all kinds of loops and mountains and, and boosters, boosters and anything, whatever, you whatever you want. And um, I think it's a good kind of um, architectural physics type. Um, learning tool. I think it's kind of cool. But anyways, moving along. Today has been a good day. It has been a productive day. Hasn't it, sweetie pie? Uh, yeah. And it's been a good day because everybody's feeling better and your hair needs some help. Listen, yeah. you got to move you over here so people can see you. You're in front of that window. Should we do something to your hair, child? Yeah. I'd say so, right? We should make a ponytail in my hair. We should, shouldn't we? Why don't we do that? Okay. Yeah. All right, why don't you get a ponytail holder for me? Okay. Okay. You do my ponytail. Okay, go get the ponytail. So I've been forgetting to share with you today. I've been so busy. And um, Curtis came home, so I decided that I was going to go to um, do a little shopping with Catherine and Caroline, they wanted to come with me. Right, girls? I get that little. So I we're at a little, here. like, um, Learning Express. It's a, a toy store that's got kind anyway. of a toy store with a meaning. You know what I mean? So we're looking through here, and I want to go and get some things to try to reorganize for school today. There's a lot of Melissa and Doug. Yeah, there's a lot of Melissa and Doug. We like Melissa and Doug, don't we? So, oh, this is kind of cool. Oh, you like yeah. that? You know, I made one. I got one of these for Alicia, oh, yeah. my niece. And she was little. A lot of fun. Got a lot of books. So. And a bookstore, toy store, learning store. I think I'm going to buy, I think I'm going to get um, a broom. This broom. A little broom. What Me and Caroline think? are getting these. Yeah. Is there glitter animals you know, in the sack? It's against my better judgment, though, because I have a feeling that this thing's. That gonna, Caroline's. I think it's going to break. <laughs> Caroline's going to break. I think Caroline's is going to break. Because she cuts everything. I know it. Look, it even snaps around my thing. And they slip out of your hand. They do, don't they? And they slip out of your hand. You squeeze them, they slip out of your hand. Mm -hmm. Well, probably they put that hole so they slip out of your hand so they don't break. Well, it's because it's fun to play with like that. All right, we got Daddy's razors, Catherine. What else do we get? Oh, light bulbs. And Caroline. And we got Caroline. Taking it easy in the car. So now, no, we got Caroline from the store. I think oh, a joke. we bought her. Oh, we bought her. We, we th got her from the shelves, didn't we? Popped her in there. I think we'll take her home. What do you think? Yeah, I guess we'll. Just kidding. We're not kidnapping or anything. <laughs> All right. Tag. Why did you take that? Did you take that off your foot? Where did that sock come from? I don't know. Who's this one? Camping gear. Camping gear. I love camping gear. Let's look at the helmets for um, Caroline because she's gonna start riding her bike. This. Yeah. Coming up pretty soon. Oh boy. Um, what do you think of that one? Well, on this one? No. That one, no. Oh, this is a cute one. So I got, I got in the van and realized what time it was. Six o'clock. Oh, my hair is blowing everywhere. You guys, anyway, don't, don't pay attention to that. And it was Periscope time. And you guys, I am so enjoying being with you. And try, I'm really trying to stay on track and not miss them. So we did the Periscope. You put this Periscope in the video. Look at how I'm parked. Ay, ay, ay. So I did the Periscope. You put the replay in this video. I can put that in this video. Maybe in, a, in another video. But it went really well. And I'm so thankful for all of you that show up. And um, like it's so good to meet well. you and learn it's about you guys. She, she didn't make it. She might be working. So then the girls, they said, I'm thirsty. I forgot to bring them water from home. So now we got to go back into the Target and get some water. Water. It's the staff of life. We've got to have water. It's sleepy time. How are you guys doing? 
Good. Doing? Good. Great. How are you doing, Good. How are you doing, Caroline? Great. 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 Spring, it's between. It's in the middle of winter and summer. Oh, I don't know. I'm sure it's Lisa. We'll see how that. We'll see. I think it was Tuesday for sure. Tuesday's going to be really nice. <coughs> so we'll see. What do you want to girls want to say to our friends? <coughs> oh, wait, wait, wait for Catherine. She's coughing. Cover your mouth. Cover your mouth, child. Ready. <coughs> set. No, no, I'm coughing. Okay. <coughs> she copies me every time I go to bed. That's okay. That's okay. Ready, set, go. Live well and be strong. And I live well and be strong. Adios, bye. So how do you like your new journal? Great. We're already writing in it. So yeah, so I bought these guys journals. All three of them, Catherine and Olivia and Nick. So they're gonna um, with these cool pens. These cool pens, and, and I got a new, new wallet. wallet. And yeah. this is my old Coleman. Yep. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so I'm excited. So you're gonna like. And that's my favorite brand. The UB. Because mm -hmm. UB, you buy one, and then they they give one to some to. Yeah, um, and they got like a bookmark yeah. and a strap on the back. And the yeah, pens. So, well, I'm glad you like it. I was thinking about you. So, um, we're going to go to sleep pretty soon, though, right? Mm-hmm. All right, that's great. You going to have a good night? Yes, very good night. Oh, good. You're anticipating a good night, huh? Uh-huh. You want to say good night to our friends? Uh-huh. Live well and be strong. Adios. Oh, Poppy's still up. He wanted to be in bed, but he got himself busy. How you doing, Daddy? I'm doing all right. How you doing? Good, good. good. You got, um... A sticker stuck on your shirt. Yeah, I don't know. Catherine smothered him with stickers, with uh, Trader Joe stickers. Ah, that wind really got my hair. Ay, ay, ay. So I am going to go to bed. Can you believe it? I watched, I, um, I was looking at some comments that you guys made. I am so thankful and it's so encouraging to get the comments that I get from you guys. I always say guys from you ladies and some men. But I shouldn't say guys. I shouldn't call everybody guys, really. It's just not right. But anyways, I do it anyway. So if you know I say guys, it's, I'm working on it. So, um, so yeah, anyways, I got sidetracked. Um, now so I hear somebody up, getting up. I just put them all to bed. Now somebody's getting up. From your comments, talking about me getting to bed on time, like this boy is not getting to bed on time because he's still up and he's. I was on the last second sentence, and can I turn the camera off? Because I don't want to be, I don't want to be humiliated. Oh, so you don't want me to share this? Whatever no. you're gonna share. Okay, so um, let me finish what I'm gonna say first. Okay. So um, I decided to take your advice and just get to bed. I'm gonna get to bed early. I'm gonna go to bed with Curtis and then. Um, when he gets up in the morning, maybe he'll get me up and maybe I'll try to edit and upload the video then. And one thing that um, with our new internet, the videos are uploading so fast, so it's not going to be really that big of a deal if I wait till morning. If I get myself up, I got to get myself up. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try it anyway. I'm not going to even have tea tonight. Oh, Next time I'm going to try to get it earlier, earlier and earlier. We got home a little late from shopping. But um, I think I'm going to really try to get going early, get my tea early, have my worship, and just get going. I'm excited because I'm really praying about this because it's just not right. I mean, if I'm following seven of the eight laws of health and trying to tell you guys all about health and, and lifestyle and eating right, living right, it's not going to do me any good to not get the sleep I need. And I keep saying this, you can see that this is such a burden for me because I am constantly talking about not getting enough sleep. I'm constantly talking to you guys about trying to get to bed early. Oh, I got to bed too late. It's just, it's just a round and round um, vicious cycle. 
and I've got to break it. So I'm really praying about it and really working on this. So you guys pray for me too that I get to bed on time so that I can be up and awake and alert and happy and cheerful and a good positive representative for Christ. So anyways, I'm going to read From Steps to Christ. And you guys are welcome to a copy of this book if you want one free. Just send me your email. I mean, send me your address in an, an email to me. StacyB88 at gmail.com if you'd like. And we'll send one right out to you. But um, for now, I am going to read to you from the chapter Growing Up into Christ. And this is the paragraph right after the one that I just read last night. And it just, as I continue to read it, it's just one that I cannot skip over. Many have an idea that they must do some part of the work alone. They have trusted in Christ for the forgiveness of sin, but now they seek by their own efforts to live aright. But every such effort must fail. Jesus says, without me ye can do nothing. Our growth and grace, our joy, our usefulness, all depend upon our union with Christ. It is by communion with Him daily, hourly, by abiding in Him, that we are to grow in grace. He is not only the author, but the finisher of our faith. It is Christ first and last and always. He is to be with us, not only at the beginning and the end of our course, but at every step of the way. David says, I have set the Lord always before me, because he is at my right hand. I shall not be moved. So we can't live a Christ-led life, a Christian life, without Christ. We can't do the work on our own. And um, so often, we so often try to do it. I mean, it's a pride thing. You know, God says, I'm going to help you. I'm going to be there for you. You're, I am your strength. And yet we continuously try to take care of every matter on our own. And um, we just need to give it to the Lord. You know, it's just, it's all throughout this book. I mean, I, I remember just reading different passages that are so similar to that, that we just can't live without Christ. It's impossible. All right, table. Not a care in the world. <laughs> So anyways, I'm gonna get myself to bed. It is 8.42, you guys. I am determined to be in this bed, this one right here, by nine o'clock. Yay! And I'm hoping to be up by four or five in the morning, five at the latest, so that I can get the school week prepared, to get this um, video edited and uploaded, and get this day started off right. I hope you are all doing well. Have a wonderful evening or day. And don't forget to live well and be strong. Bye-bye.